pipeline picking and slot catcher modeling have been a very difficult challenge for a long, long time. Now, thanks to VMG, we can model pipeline picking very easily in VMG dynamic simulation. In this example, we have a peak launcher, a pipeline, flow control valve, a peak receiver, and a slot catcher. The slot catcher is a horizon vessel with a length of 500 feet and a diameter of 3 feet. The pipeline has a total length of 22,000 feet with a diameter of 20 inch. The profile can be found in this table. Currently, in the pipeline, there is a total liquid holdup of 8,215 cubic feet. The liquid level in slot catcher is about 4%. Since what it comes to slot catcher is almost the same as what goes out of the slot catcher, the liquid level in slot catcher remains fairly constant. Now let's launch the pig. The pink line is the peak location. After about 2,000 seconds, the peak is received in the peak receiver. The red line is the liquid to the slot catcher. As the peak moves along the pipeline, more and more liquid goes to the slot catcher. And then at the end of the peaking process, the liquid to the slot catcher almost drops to zero and then goes back to its normal rate very slowly. The green line is the liquid goes out of the slot catcher and it remains fairly constant. The black line is the liquid level in the slot catcher. At the end of the picking process, the liquid level in slot catcher reaches the highest point and then it drops sharply. The blue line is the total liquid holdup in the pipeline. At about 8,000 seconds, the liquid holdup in the pipeline reaches its high point again. It seems it is a sign we need to relaunch the picking process. Thanks for watching this video. It is brought to you by Guofu Chen. More interesting topics can be found at showcase.guofuchen.com.